Continuing to fill questions for US Amelia, I have a student asking from within our Telegram group about how to go through the Clinical Mastery Series forms, the CMS forms for 2CK, which are the NBME subject specific forms. These are very important to go through, okay? Even if you're studying for step one, very important that you know how to ultimately go through the, the CMS forms for 2CK uh, because your score is going to fucking matter, clearly. So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Give the video a like. I really appreciate it. Find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical. M-E-H-L-M-A-N underscore medical. Links down below. Find me on Telegram. Links to the Telegram group and channel are down below. Now start the clip. So student wants to know about how to go through the CMS forms, clinical master series forms for 2CK. And as I said, these are the NBME subject specific forms. So for instance, we have all the full length NBME exams. Those are just random mode essentially for questions, right? Well, if you pull all those questions out and put them into subject specific 50 question forms, you get the CMS forms. So there's 44 forms altogether, including the offline ones. So we've got uh, obviously for the different subjects, eight internal medicine forms, we've got eight surgery forms, six OBS and gyne, six pediatrics, five psych, we have three family medicine, we have two emergency medicine, uh, we have six neuro forms, okay? Uh, I believe those are the those are all the forms of 44. So all of those forms, very important for you to go through, as important as the NBME exam. So how do we go through them, okay? So what you're gonna do for 2CK clearly is you're gonna finish eWorld. There's gonna be those of you who are on rotations, there's gonna be those of you who have finished med school already. So for those of you who finished med school, you're going to finish all of UWorld, then you're going to do all the CMS forms. It's going to take you three weeks. If you do two per day, 44 forms, okay, 22 days. So you do all of UWorld, then you're going to do all the CMS forms over roughly three weeks. You're going to do offline, and we have means six through eight and free 120. You're going to do a second pass of all the clinical master's series forms, yes. Then you're then you're going to do online forms 9 through 12, and then you're going to set your 2CK. That's the consolidated version of it. If you're on rotations right now and you need to ace each individual shelf, you're going to do all the UWorld questions for that shelf exam. Uh, there's a time and place for doing more QBank questions, especially if uh, students are on longer rotations. We need to fill in the time. But you're going to do, at a minimum, all the UWorld questions for each shelf exam slash rotation. You're going to do the clinical master series forms for that rotation twice. Okay, you really need to know those questions for the shelf exam. And ultimately, when you get to your 2CK, you will have finished all the CMS forms and the UWorld questions accordingly. You know the deal. I'm going to continue to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.